Hey Gemini, thank you for checking out my channel for the love of water to row. My name is Keonti and I'm going to give you guys a whatever is comes out kind of reading, okay? <laughs> Again, this is going to be for the sign of Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, as well as the Gemini Cross Watcher. We're going to talk about what's going on, what don't you see, what can or should you do about the situation, and what the outcome will be if you take my advice or if you take the advice from Spirit on the read, okay? Gemini, it is a general read, so everything I say won't resonate for every last single one of you, but some things will, some things won't. Make sure that you keep what resonates for you and release what doesn't. If I get it right for you guys, please take care of your girl with the like, comment, subscribe, and share. And if you guys are interested in booking me for a private reading, my email information is provided in the description box below. All right, Gemini, let's get a couple on what's going on here. The chariot. You could be dealing with the Cancerian. This could be something about a trip or traveling. Yeah, nine of cups is under here. Some of you are definitely dealing with the water sign. But, what, but what's happening right now is something involving with forward movement. Definitely could be about traveling a trip. But I feel like you're trying to figure out how you can move forward with something and get wish fulfillment. Right? I'm feeling like having something go the way you want it to go. Right? Definitely movement energy, but going in the direction that you want it to go in. So give me more for what's going on. The Knight of cups. Some of you are definitely dealing with the water sign. Give me one more on what's going on here. One more for Gemini. The devil. Ooh you could be dealing with a Capricorn or a um, Cancerian here. But I feel like what's happening here, Gemini. <clears throat> someone could def there, there could be some obsession about traveling or a change. There could be stress about traveling or change or movement here. Some of you point blank in the period here, <laughs> Gemini, you may have a, can a Cancer or a Capricorn that's like a little bit of nap, a little bit obsessed with you. There's definitely amorous energy here with the Knight of Cups here. This is love and assistance here. The chariot is all about forward movement, but the devil is here. Hmm. So is someone stressed out? Because I, under here I have the uh, four of pentacles and the three of pentacles. There could be stress about money, about finances. There could definitely be an energy of that, about forward movement here. Someone could definitely be stressing about moving. But there is definitely energy about, there, there's what's going on here, I feel like maybe some of you have more than one option, perhaps. But there's definitely love and adoration going on here, for sure. I don't, I, let's, let's see what you don't see about the situation here. What is it that Gemini doesn't see here? What is it that Gemini doesn't see? The Seven of Swords. Gemini, maybe you are stressing. Maybe you're trying to strategize something here. This could definitely be just something that's, that you're dealing with, that you're stressed out with dealing with the money. Or feeling like, with, I, feel like I feel like it's about money with the devil here. It could be like stress over finances or stress over how to make accomplish something. Some of you, there is someone here that's kind of obsessing over you that wants to come towards you. You don't see that they're strategizing here. This person could be a bit sneaky and clever. If this isn't just you trying to strategize your way, you, like I said, you could be trying to strategize your way into some sort of movement, or this is someone trying to strategize their way towards you. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles is under the deck. Yeah. So, so there's definitely either a strategy that you don't see coming from someone, or you're or you're strategizing it. You're trying to find your figure your way out of something. Give me more for Gemini for what you don't see here. Give me more for Gemini for what you don't see. There's definitely sneaky energy here. Page of Pentacles. So so listen. Either you are planning, you could definitely be like planning something. It could ha have everything to do with the trip, but it could definitely have, like there could be stress about money and finances here. If this is not you doing this, Gemini, this is someone strategizing their way towards you. They're devising some sort of plan here because they, like, I feel like this person could definitely be obsessed, enamored. I feel like there's a lot of uh, sexual chemistry attraction this could be someone with the plan you don't see someone planning something to come towards you give me one more for what you don't see yeah the empress all right gemini okay so gemini the fool you know what you don't see i do feel like there's some sort of strategy here and the strategy has everything to do with the empress you could be dealing with the taurus or a libra but the empress is the queen of all queens so it definitely feels like there's a strategy for this abundance, for this growth, this development. If this is about love, someone thinks you're absolutely positively beautiful. They see you as a divine partner and a counterpart. You don't see how much this person is obsessing over you, or you don't see some sort of street secret strategy that they have because they see you this way. 
Gemini, or this is just you don't see, you're not seeing how really abundant something's going to turn out. But I do feel like there's strategy, like maybe you haven't figured out the plan yet, right? And you're stressing about the plan because you're, you 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 definitely have a plan to move forward. There's something that you want to do. There's something that you want to put energy into. It's going to work out with the Empress here. So let's see what can or should you do here, Gemini? What can or should Gemini do in this situation? King of Wands. Take action. Get active. Aries, Leo, Sag energy. Mm-hmm. The moon and the seven of cups. Some of you definitely have someone coming towards you that's fantasizing. It's all in their feelings. They could definitely be a bit obsessive. Someone, there's a man with a plan here for some of you, Gemini, for sure. There's a man with a plan. But this, if this is if this if this isn't about love and this is just about something that you're going through personally, your advice is to take action. What you should do is take action. The King of Wands is a leader. So this is the Seven of Cups with the King of Wands. So this is like figuring out, exploring your options and then figuring out which one you're going to take. The moon. You may also have to search your emotions here. I do feel like there's energy of secret strategies coming on coming up strongly here. For sure. But some of you definitely, Gemini, there's a man with a plan here, King of Wands. If this is not you, need if this is not you taking some sort of action, for sure. Okay, you could be dealing with the Aries, Leo, Sag. I got Capricorn. I got Cancerian. I got Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. I got Taurus, Libra, strongly here. So let's see the outcome. Let's see what the outcome for this is for Gemini. What's the outcome of Gemini? Death. There's going to be an ending, changing, a transformation. Queen of Cups. Ooh we. The high priestess. Some of you are definitely dealing with a Scorpio, a Cancer, or a Pisces, period. But Gemini, the high priestess is, is she who knows. So this is using your intuition. The high priestess and the ace of swords. So there's something that, you're in, that you intuitively know. I do feel like some of you, you have a plan here and with the high priestess and the ace of swords here. The cards are telling me that if you're planning, if you're strategizing something kind of in secrecy and silence, I do think that's the right thing to do. I do feel like the outcome is going to be an end change and transformation. For some of you, this could even be about work. You could be ready to leave your job or something like that for sure with the hierophant here. But for some of you, if this is about love, there's, there's someone that's definitely coming towards you. There's a man with the plan. And, and the outcome is something ending, changing, and transforming. Intuitively, Gemini, you may already know this. If you're not dealing with a Taurus, an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, or a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces here. The Queen of Cups to the Nine of Pentacles to the Ace of Cups. Yeah, listen. I feel like for some of you, it's just simply you being a little bit stressed because you're ready to get some forward movement and you're ready to put a lot of energy and love and effort into something here. For sure. I feel like you don't see just how abundant this is going to be because you're still in a strategy period about this. And I do feel like you're possibly stressing. What you should do is just go ahead and take action because the outcome is something that's going to end, change, and transform. For some of you, you could be getting a dream job here. But if this is a person, oh boy, the Queen of Cups, the Nine of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups. The Queen is, the, this is the Queen of Hearts. This is queen, the Queen of someone's heart. The Nine of Pentacles is the energy of being single, solid, stable, and abundant. And here's the Ace of Cups, an offer. So there is getting ready to be some sort of huge change that's getting ready to happen here in the outcome. Regardless, regardless if this is just something that you're doing or if this is the energy of someone coming towards you. This is turning out beautifully. We already have the empress here and what you don't see. And this is the pregnant lady. You don't have to be literally pregnant, but she's giving birth, right? And you don't see. There's a man For some of you, there's a man with the plan coming towards you or you just are the man with the plan. But this is something that's going to turn out beautifully, Gemini, and you don't see it just yet. Just yet, but there's a strategy at play. All right, Gemini, I love you guys. If I got it right for you, make sure you take care of me with the like, comment, subscribe, share. If you're interested in booking me, please email me. Stay beautiful, stay blessed, take care of yourselves and your families. I have messages for you again. Bye, Gemini.